of his arm, and I saw it was kind of limp, so I knew that, that that was the end of that. I saw he went to tap, and then he kind of said, like, I'm not, it seemed that he said, I'm not going to do this, and then I felt it kind of go limp a little bit. When you took him down, did you feel like he had no answer for, you know, your, your wrestling? Or? It was um, pretty quick. Well, he was pressing into me, so I threw the headlock, and uh, I, was, I had it very, very tight, and he was definitely trying to make a move and get out of there, and then I slid to uh, the leg in, and I didn't feel that comfortable initially. Uh, I stepped out of the leg, came out to the front headlock, and that's when I decided this seems pretty tight. I'm going to sit with this guillotine choke, see what happens here. Did a performance of the night bonus linger in the back of your head? Is that something that you were looking for? Uh, well, we were in the meeting with Dana yesterday, and he was hyping us up a little bit, you know, uh, talking a little bit about that. And it always kind of plays into the back of your head. You know, I'm uh, in the process of trying to buy my first home, so uh, definitely crept into the back of my head a little bit but just winning was the priority tonight and finally did you yeah yeah exactly he spoke about that a little bit so that was in the back of my head a little bit but I, winning like I said was the priority I wasn't going to do anything stupid to jeopardize uh, the win uh, just for a bonus but it, it was there and I, I went for it did you feel any of those octagon jitters at all I mean um, I'll tell you what about an hour prior to the fight when we started warming up a little bit the jitters crept up on me but uh i had uh, the menace back there with me my coaches joe panarello greg de pasquale and uh they do an excellent job of keeping me calm and just motivating me letting me know that i can hang with anybody so that that went away as soon as we started getting warm what was the what was this what was this week like for you because obviously this is a this has been a unique fight week for the ufc yeah. in general did it affect you at all um it, it was definitely unique, um, being that uh, there were some changes on the card, but uh, I tried not to let any of that affect the way I was going to perform. I stayed the first fight. The time changed a little bit, but um, I think that was for the better. It gave us a little bit more time to settle in and, and relax. Today, this morning, I got to eat with my dad and, and just uh, just as things were normal, almost like my last fights in uh, Atlantic City. So um, nothing crazy. Uh, you know, just kind of felt bad for the other guys, felt bad for TJ, you know, and uh, that was that. Did, did, were you keeping up with that, or are you just, this week, were you just, like, cutting away? Or? I only found out, I saw Hennen in uh, in the check scale on Wednesday when I was uh, working out. He was in my workout room, so I didn't know that I, I, there was any issue. Uh, looking back on it now, when I left medicals on uh, uh, yesterday, there was an ambulance, uh, a couple of guys with a stretcher knocking on the door, and I had to let them in. I thought it was just for someone in the hotel. I'm assuming now that it likely was for him or for Cejudo. I don't know what happened, but um, I didn't even know until we sat down and Bert ran us through a meeting, and I heard TJ doing an interview behind me, and I heard just kind of barely something about a different opponent being a professional. And I turned my head around, and that's when I knew like something had changed, but I tried to just set my focus on my opponent and... You know, he's a professional. He's going to do what he has to do tonight. So. Now, you didn't take any damage in the fight. When would you like to get back in there? Um, I mean, I'd like to get back in there again before the end of the year. You know, as long as I'm healthy, I'm, I'm down to fight whenever. You know, it, uh, health being the main concern, and I feel great right now. So, whenever. You still have your gloves on, are you? Uh... Yeah. Well, the gloves came <laughs> off, and then we took some pictures, and the gloves went back on. So, uh, and then I asked if they wanted them to stay on. So, that's why they're, that's why they're still here. But <laughs> yeah, I mean, I'll probably just walk around like this all night. Yeah. How does it feel? I mean, as a as an athlete, you know, just doing this. I mean, I don't know. Is this just another day, or is like no? This you, you know you. I mean, you know what? Everyone has been kind of asking me all week, friends, family. Uh, this has your, been your dream for so long. How, doesn't this feel great? And I say no because uh, I just look at it as I've been climbing one mountain. I got to the top, and you look up, and there's a whole other mountain to climb. You know, uh, being that I was a wrestler, I, my goal has never been to just be around and to be uh, relevant. You know, I always want to win, whatever it is. If I'm in a tournament, I want to be the champion, uh, states, nationals, whatever the case may be. So uh, I'm here to win and win as, as much as possible, win all the time. I want that belt someday, and I know I have a lot of work to do, so I'm just going to, you know, keep my head down, keep working hard, keep training with these guys that are excellent, and uh, and, and try to get there someday. And how are you going to celebrate this victory tonight? Uh, I have some family uh, that made it in, uh, my trainers, 
So uh, we're gonna go out and uh, have, have a nice dinner and uh, socialize a little bit, have a good time. It's been a, it's been a while since I've been able to kick back and relax. So um, I'm looking forward to that. I'm looking forward to getting home to uh, my girlfriend and my seven and a half month old daughter, who, uh, who uh, I miss quite a bit from this being a long week. So yeah, definitely definitely gonna celebrate. Congratulations! A bit. Thank you very Thank much, you. Thank, Thank you. you.